Welcome back to another edition of TN Toys. This time we've got the Wave 3 of the Marvel Legends 3 and 3 quarter inch Retro Kenner line using the Marvel characters. Now, first up, we've got the Astonishing Ant Man. I believe this is the Hank Pym version of Ant Man. Yep, Pym particles. Well, actually, it sort of leaves it a bit ambiguous whether it is Hank or Scott, but we're going to go with Hank because he's the original and only Ant Man. I think Ant Man's original appearance was like Astonishing Tales of an issue number that I cannot remember right now. Now I'm thinking that the releases of these toys are where the character had their first appearance or near to. So I'm guessing they used the Astonishing Ant-Man logo because that's probably a bit more iconic than the Astonishing Tales stuff. I get the same with the Hulk. I, I think he appeared in what's, what's something like Strange Tales or something. I suppose that doesn't really matter. Ant-Man. The token villain of this wave, Bullseye, comes with the same weapons as Elektra. I'm surprised they did Bullseye so early, and Elektra and Daredevil all basically back to back. And they all have their own little bios. And the inevitable, the reissue of Cyclops with the new card back. I think it was actually a better paint job than my first edition, although the artwork is still great. I kind of like the other one first edition artwork and again I don't know why they did this so early they did Grey Hulk so early now let's that's what Grey Hulk here let's get the green one out for a comparison different artwork now if I'm honest I think I prefer the head on the Grey Hulk over the head on the Green Hulk I would have preferred this one in green and there may be a Grey Hulk some ways off down the line, but you can't help Hasbro for doing a few cheapos. And we get our second member of the Fantastic Four, the Invisible Woman. So it's nice to get her done nice and early. Again, probably the same body buck as Electra and Ms. Marvel. Um, last but by no means least is the Vision off the heels from the recent TV series. This series is just such a great little retro throwback series. I really want them to do. All the figures they did in the original Secret Wars line. Now, we're only a couple missing now. A, a lot of people are wanting Dr. Octopus. A lot of people are wanting Dr. Octopus. Now, what I would like to see is all the Marvel characters that appear in the, the Marvel Universe handbook line. So, all these type of characters. Just such a nice, simple designs. Well, I drop it as beautiful very left of field character to do but I wouldn't be surprised with this line again characters like Annihilus I'd love to see them more and more of these I know more obscure like like I said from the 60s up until the 90s I don't want to see any of the new fangled characters and we can't have Angel without Archangel so I definitely want to see both versions of that there are so many like classic classic true Marvel characters that they can do before they start delving into newer stuff which I'm not a fan of and how I grow up in these comics oh man Blackheart as well just some of this stuff I'm, so I look at this and this makes me want so many of these characters but let's get back to um, the figures at hand so what do you think we've seen what wave 4 is I've already discussed wave 4 in the last video on this line cannot wait to see what we're going to get we need a Thor for the Avengers Pretty common on a Thor card though. I think the next character we're getting from Thor line is actually Loki. We're getting Loki before we get Thor. Full time. Cannot wait until we get Reed. And obviously, like to see more of the big guys like the Rhino, the Thing. Definitely the Juggernaut. Definitely want the Juggernaut in this line sooner rather than later. And I don't know who else they could put on the Ant Man cards. Maybe the Wasp if, if they really want to go down that line, but I can't think of what her first appearance is to see if it's all tied into where the characters appeared first. Either way, what do you think of the line? Do you want, what characters do you want to see in this line? Don't forget to love, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.